Hi guys, I had a few requests to do a do-it-yourself ringmaster costume tutorial. This will take you under 45 minutes and will cost you under $20. You will need black wired ribbon, gold accents, a pen, some gold bling, some scissors, preferably some fabric scissors, fabric glue, any kind of your choice, a piece of cardboard, and a shirt, long sleeve, that is about three sizes larger than your baby. Also, three gold buttons. So let's begin. So for this tutorial, I'm using an old pink shirt, but you will want to buy a red shirt. They sell them at Walmart for $3, so go ahead and buy one that is three sizes larger. And what I'm doing is I'm determining the center of the shirt and using a pen or a marker, go ahead and start drawing your design like so you'll now want to do the same design on the right side Now using the same marker, go ahead and draw out a V neckline. Use your fabric scissors to go ahead and cut away the portion that needs to be cut out, keeping the vest intact. Flip over the shirt and you are going to start to do your design for the tail coat. Figure out where the center is at and from the center um, create the left side of the tail coat. work on the center and you're going to want to do the same design on the right side of the, the shirt. Make sure they're even. Now cut out your tail coat using fabric scissors.
Since the shirt is larger than your baby's size, you'll want to roll each sleeve twice to make sure that it fits properly on your baby. Go ahead and roll each sleeve twice and you may secure each side using fabric glue. Once you have glued your sleeves, go ahead and add your gold bling around the cuff of the sleeve, just like so. It's now time to add the gold trim. Add glue around the edges where you cut and start gluing on the gold trim. I highly recommend adding a piece of cardboard between the front and back of the shirt because the glue can seek through the front should look like this. All you have to do is add the gold button to the front. Once you are done with the front, you are also going to need to add trim to the back. Do not forget the collar and to add the gold buttons. Your finished piece should look something like this. You don't want to forget your bow tie. So be sure to cut a piece of ribbon about six to eight inches long and a two inch wide piece of ribbon. Glue both ends of the ribbon to make a circle. Next, Pinch the sides to create a bow tie form and glue on the small piece of ribbon to secure the bow into place. Fluff it out to your liking. Glue your black bow tie directly onto your white bodysuit. I do not have a white bodysuit on hand at this moment, but make sure you buy one that fits your baby. You can also add suspenders using any type of ribbon. Here's another look at the finished product. 